What is that? Oh my god. Oh. It's bloody and I'm fresh. Gonna... Oh my god, what is that? This is not your typical Randonautica thing. I mean, they keep leading, leaving us coordinates. It's all we're finding. Usually you find like weird dolls or just weird artifacts or items. And so far, the last couple of Randonautica adventures, we have found nothing but coordinates left for us. It's a dog and it's dead. Oh my God. Tell me this isn't weird. Field of screams. Oh God. We keep ending up in locations because of those coordinates in places that just seem unrealistic. You ready to do this? Yeah. Let's do it, Ninja. <laughs> if somebody is in here and you're not letting yourself be known, that's not going to be good for you when we meet. I am armed, fully loaded. So it would be best in your best interest just to let me know that you're here. All right, guys. Well, this is the second house that we came in in this abandoned town. And as soon as we walked in on the right on this string, there's like this burnt up looking gross ball of some sort in the garage. And there's more coordinates there. If you haven't been following the last three videos in this series about a stalker leaving creepy coordinates, it's important to catch up before watching this video check out the playlist, which includes the previous video linked in the comment below. Then come back and watch this video right away. Guys, what do you think about this? <laughs> I can't. Oh my God. Oh. We're just gonna go right across the street. Why are we supposed to be here? I don't know. We're gonna just explore at this point. What the heck? This is amazing. Look at this. Oh, oh my God. Is that abandoned way back there? Is that... Holy crap, they have their own pond? <sighs> or something? There's a bird house way out there. Look at this. You think that's a, a house? That's... I don't think that's part of any of this. Hello? You smell it? Oh. The only way in is to climb through the window. I don't think I want to do that. This is cool. are boarded up. Somebody knew this was like this and oh. boarded everything up, right? And it's just sitting here? Well, it didn't... All these people didn't just leave for no reason. It's just all boarded, like, you know? That's a, uh... That's a police station over there. Great. <laughs> oh. I don't know if I want to... There's cameras on the back of that building. I know, but that's the police. Oh, I thought I seen something over there. Oh, my. Uh, maybe we can get in, maybe. I don't really care walking through all these. Because right. we have like 20 more houses. <laughs> I don't know if we can get into all of them, but. Woo. 
That's crazy. Keep moving my truck. I just seen a, tr a vehicle. What? I just seen a vehicle go that way. No, you didn't. Hundred percent. That was a silver truck. It went this way. I don't. I mean, they might have pulled into one of the houses. I swear to God, though. Look at this place. Oh my goodness. This is beautiful. Did you guys see that on camera? A vehicle down here, silver vehicle, black tinted windows. Just it looked like you're driving across in the field. It was the weirdest thing. Look at this place. Man, they really know how to. What the heck? Board things up. Are those fireworks. It says your mama's crib. <laughs> Yo, mama's crib. Those are fireworks. Somebody tried to blow up the door. <laughs> yeah, I guess maybe. I just, think. Well, there's no. Oh, well, they lit it right here. Yes. Wow. People are. Crazy. Hold on this way. Because there's walkways around the house mm -hmm. this way. Woo. Place is like highly boarded. There's a pool. A pool. Let's go for a Driving by slow. They're gonna pass my truck. They already did. They came by this way. And they pulled a Yui. It could be like security or something. Maybe. Alright guys, we got back into our car and we drove down a little, a little ways to the next house, the next series of houses. And um Still, Still just as creepy. <laughs> Look at this. Ooh. Now this looks like something from a horror movie. Yes, it does. This is going to be good photography right here. Really good photography. I want to get a photo on our way out of this place. Wow. <laughs> creepy. Well, we definitely... Let's just get... Hope we can get up in that window. If we can get up the top of this. Uh, I don't think that's open. Is it open? The window's open up there. Wow. It's like a little cottage. Oh, that's how you... Wait a minute. Access. <laughs> okay. Damn, we need one of them. Ooh. <laughs> it's massive. Alright. Alright, in we go. Let's go straight to the basement. You Whoa. Have basements, but it's flooded. Yeah, it's flooded. Oh yeah. Wow. There's a garage. Oh. Look at oh. oh. There's more coordinates right here. Look at this. What is that? No way. There's no look at Come on. Let me turn this off. Look. It's just hanging on this weird... What is that? Ugh. What is that? Yeah, these are... <sighs> There's no way. Look at this. Do you think that truck? No. Do you think that truck... That's a possibility. Because it was really weird to see somebody driving around yeah, like that. Yeah, there's no civilization. Wait, so what is this? I'm... Is that like a walnut or something? What is that? It almost looks like a bouncy ball or... A world. <sighs> Alright guys, well what this is the second house that we came in in this abandoned town. And as soon as we walked in on the right on this string, there's like this burnt up looking gross ball of some sort in the garage. And there's more coordinates there. God dang it. Go figure that. So now we have to look these coordinates up. We're just playing a cat and mouse game. That's so it's four one point eight seven three 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 seven. Negative eight seven point six seven one three one seven. I'll pause it and put it up on the screen. Look it up for us. Let us know down in the comments what this place is or where it's at in the world. This is all we're finding at different locations, and we're just going and exploring around all these places that they're, we're being led to. I don't know why. Something has to unravel at some point. You want to hold on to this? Like, uh, I don't have my backpack.
What? Did you hear something? It's water dripping. No, I thought I heard talking like the whole time. Oh. Probably. Is there any? Might as well just go on and go on to the house. Wow. Whoa. Holy smokes. Now this looks like a fire. I know I always say that, but look at the colors. It's not a fire. No? No, that's just water decay. Holy creepy. Oh, wow. There's probably squatters. It says he, 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 ho. Oh, what is that? Oh my God. Oh, you can't show that. That's like a raccoon or a cat or something. Um, I can't. It's bloody and I'm fresh. Gonna... I'm gonna throw up. Oh my God, what is that? Oh God. Okay, this place is giving me the creeps now. Yeah, that is... Hello? I just pictured like a, a mutant, stop, like stop. Eating, eating that. Please. That is gross. What is that? I think... I thought that was... I thought that was all blood, but that was already, that's been sitting here a long time. That's a, like a dead raccoon. Oh. And somebody spray painted it, I think. Oh. Yeah. Ugh. Whoa. This place is insane. Look at the French doors or whatever. Oh, oh I want a picture of this. That's a crazy fireplace. Insta Urbex. Whoa. What does this have to do with serial killers? I don't know. I mean, it's a perfect spot for a serial killer to get away with uh, something. Heck yeah, it is. Oh my god, that was a... Your flash? No, my reflection on the mirror looks like a fucking oh. cloud. It looks like a cloud. Look. Oh, she's spooking herself. When I was taking a picture, look. Oh. Yeah, can you see the... God, this is old. Look at this. That's what very old. Man? What? I wouldn't do nothing. There's stairs upstairs. <laughs> there's stairs upstairs. I mean, there's stairs. <laughs> there's also... Wow. I thought we were in here before. Huh? What is this? There's just like a nook room or something. Yeah, it's a little, it's a bedroom. Huh. There's a fireplace. Wow. These houses have a lot of fireplaces. They do. I mean, if they're old. That's where we came in, so we got to go back. Oh, you get a picture. Not looking right. Hold on. Let me go first. Go no, I don't want you going first. All this yeah. Oh, yeah. Hey, look. That's not old. Uh, there is somebody sleeping in here doing something in here. Yeah. Hello? We're not the cops, we're just exploring. Oh my gosh, and there's an attic. Can you please not come on the stairs? Oh. How safe is this floor? Oh my god. Roof access. Look Holy at this. Holy 70s carpet. Um, not all of this carpet. Hello? Oh, wow. 
That's old. Wait, it doesn't smell that bad up here. Because it's ventilated. <laughs> <laughs> oh, what is all this on the walls? Oh. West Post, Post Coach Line. What the hell is this? Wow. How to keep warm? Alfred Dunhill. And powerful paddle schemer. Huh. Hmm. You can take a picture of these. Look I behind guess, there, it's untouched. I, that's what I got to get a close up. Yes, then we can search it later. Yep. Because why would you have that on your wall? Like, that's it's crazy. part of wallpaper. I know. It, it is wallpaper. Look. Like, like you could buy the, that wallpaper, that style, back in the day. There's a carpet in the bathroom. Yeah, this is definitely old. Oop. <laughs> I'm going to go this way. Got to be real careful. Oh. Dang, the yellow room. Right, girls. Man, this reminds me of something that you and me could buy and fix up and turn into a bed and breakfast. Uh, I don't know if there's any save in this. <laughs> Maybe. Well, not. <laughs> Why are there so many beds in one room? Ugh, I'm not going any further in here. This is gross. Why is there so many beds in one room? I don't know. Was there? Yeah, look how many beds are in there. Well, maybe they had multiple kids. Wow. It's not weird for kids to share bedrooms. What is all this? Is this from the ceiling? Yeah, insulation and old um, ceiling right. tile. This, this house is a little smaller, but it's still decent. The architecture in these houses are amazing. It's, it's very old, yeah. I like the style. Mm-hmm. Like, like, I would totally buy, like, invest in a house in the future like this, you I know? I like this room in here. Am I going crazy? Okay, I thought that that was in there. No, I like that, too, what you were talking about. Yeah, I like it. What the? Uh, oh, that's underwater. Is that another way to the basement? Yeah. Holy crap, that's underwater. It's like the Titanic. Okay. Oh, look at the powder room. ADT security box. Damn, that looks new. That's kind of... That's not new. We had one of those in our house when we bought it. And it was from the uh, 60... Yeah, that's true. 60-something. I mean, so you're already in there. I'm going to go this way. Which way am I going? You just go out this way. Come out the side. Guys, this place, where all these places so far are pretty amazing. The architecture is amazing. And this is not your typical Randonautica thing. I mean, they keep lead, leaving us coordinates. It's all we're finding. Usually you find like weird dolls or just weird artifacts or items. And so far, the last couple of Randonautica adventures, we have found nothing but coordinates left for us. And we know it's for us because it's all the same style. This is weird. And we're just going to keep going. We're going to keep going to all these coordinates as long as our everyday schedule allows. And um, just keep traveling to them. And eventually, somehow, this has all got to make sense. And we need you more than ever to help us figure everything out. Let us know down in the comments what you guys think, your thoughts, your ideas, everything. Because me and Tina are lost for words right now. Let's get back to it. Deer! It's probably just people exploring. I don't know. It is. They're in that house. It's people exploring. The one we just came out of, the satanic house. I need a picture of this though. I'm gonna cut, grab some photos. Hey, do you know what's going on with these props? No, oh, not, not necessarily.
necessarily, no. Yeah, it's, uh, it's our second time around, and I was... No idea. I was going to church, and there was somebody at that first house over there by the white pillars. And I think they were just dumping, dumping stuff in the woods. Oh. Yeah. Huh. So yeah, it's all abandoned. One person lives in the next one over there. Really? Oh, really? Yeah, Holy they got dogs, so be careful. They live in the middle of nowhere? <laughs> yeah, and right, yeah. we're wondering what it is, too. Uh, it's like abandoned property. It is, floor. it is. <laughs> we kind of need to photograph. We oh, yeah, this one, this one is. We're documenting yeah. it all. That one so. is. Yeah, yeah, definitely. We'll there have fun. Yeah. Enjoy. Yeah. They'll probably be torn down by the time we come back. Yeah, yeah. 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 Exactly. <laughs> yeah. All right, have a go. Ahead. You too. So, we can't, so somebody's living in this one? Maybe that's the truck that you've seen. Coming out. We'll see. If anybody fits the perfect description of a serial killer, who is it? Oh my god, why was he so orange? Well, and he was very charming and like, he was like, he almost reminded me of Jeffrey Dahmer without glasses. Stop. But serial killers are usually like, if you look, do history, on, yeah. or if you look up, if you look up information on them. Uh, they try to win you over. Yeah, if you look up information on serial killers, they're usually like very charming and like. How does he know like somebody that. lives there? Yeah, exactly. He's like, yeah, he's like, goes all abandoned, but then look, he's going in right there. He lives there. <laughs> That's a little weird. He said someone lives there. And they and... have dogs. Be careful. Hmm. And where did he just go? He just went in that on, the house he was talking about. We're gonna go. But yeah, if somebody fit the description of a serial killer, it's him. <laughs> I'm getting in the truck. He's way too nice. How are you gonna tell us somebody lives there and then you pull in here? <laughs> yeah. Really. <laughs> Maybe, maybe he wanted to go there. I don't know. That's weird. We're going to get in the truck and drive down a little bit. We still got quite a bit to explore. So, see you in a minute. All right, guys. Well, we pulled into another property, and it's really diagonal from the property that this that guy in the silver car went into. And that whole situation is weird. That property is massive. It's obviously abandoned. Uh, we drove past it and looked, and he went in there, and he went in some, like, back alleyway. And he told us that to stay away from that property because someone lives there with their dog. But, but it is right obviously there. abandoned. What do you guys think? Let us know down in the comments. I think he was way too charming. Oh, here he comes. It was very weird. Don't look at him. Just look up and look like a Yeah. So I just want to okay. see where he goes. Ooh, yeah, I, he's, I he's falling out. He might pull right in. I can see him again. You kind of, you pulled in, like... I can see him if I face it this way. Yeah. Guys, where's he? What's he doing? Wait. Oh, there he is. See him? Yeah, we're trying to see him from. I can see him through my camera. Is he coming this way? Um, I don't know. I don't know what he's doing. No, he's leaving. He just pulled back there really slowly. He's crazy. Holding where we were parked in the parking lot. No, there he goes. He's going down the street. He's going super slow. Look, someone planted fresh stuff. No, I'm just kidding. What the heck? And then he left, so I think we're gonna go over to the other place here in a minute. Yeah, we're gonna see what's going on. He maybe he left us something. Maybe it wasn't the silver truck. He's weird. Looks like. Oh. Man, what's up with all the rose bushes and stuff wait, around wait, these wait. properties? I think that's a door under the wood board, though. Round door. Yeah, that's locked over. That's locked. Yeah. So far, this day has been pretty crazy. Um, yeah. There's two people, three... Well, actually, there's a bunch of people we've seen. Quite a few. And as for the coordinates, I mean, anybody who has talked to us today... Could be our stalker. Yeah. Or just could be the person messing with us. I don't know. I don't even know if we call this Randonautica anymore at this no, point. It's, this is, somebody's just yeah. messing with us now at this point. With GPS coordinates I mean, and I locations guess. and creepy locations. Well, this, is more this is like... Oh look, this is freshly trailed. Yeah, it's freshly trailed. I mean like cut, look it. We keep ending up in locations because of those coordinates in places that just seem unrealistic. Just like out of this world. Like this whole freaking town is like something you would see out of a like a horror movie skit. Right? Yeah. It's insane. Oh my god, look. Well, that's boarded. Whoa! <laughs> 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 
<laughs> well, there can't be nobody in here because if they are, they're dead because they can't get out. <laughs> oh my god. Yeah, this is boarded. Yeah. There's people way off in the it's field, the distance. Weird. I can't really zoom in on them, but I might try to later. Oh, great. It's weird. Coming this way. <laughs> what if they're homeless and they're going in for the night? Then I guess that's what they're doing. You know what I mean? Yeah. They're so far away that I know that I have time to. They're just people. That's a weird spot to be. Yeah, they're right like in the middle. Look at the tree. Look at the tree formation right here. It's a big, like goes in a circle. See the trees, they go in a circle and it opens yeah. up in the middle. Where'd they go? I don't know, they're probably hiding from us. All right, guys, we are going to head over to that spot that that charming young man told us to stay away from because somebody lives in there and there's a dog there. So we're going to go scope it out anyways. Fingers crossed we don't get murdered. Yeah. <laughs> See you guys in a minute. All right, guys. Um, <laughs> Nobody lives here. He's weird. There's no way no one lives here. He said a guy with his dog lives here. Somebody that still lives there with the dog. And then he proceeded to come over here. And now we're in a vulnerable state where if someone comes behind us, we can't get out. Did you think about that one? Because of this. It sounded like he wanted us to just stay away from here. Personally, you think you'd hear a dog barking, right? Not necessarily. For sure. Not necessarily. Hello? I heard somebody just make a the shuffle. We're just exploring. You didn't hear the in the downstairs? I did. If somebody lives here, we don't want to bug you. Just shout out and tell us. Or make a noise and we'll leave. Oh, that's weird. I heard something go. Well, let's just walk, walk around, around, around a little bit. If there's a dog, we would have been lucky, I know. There's multiple ways into this place. People climbed up this, climbed up mm -hmm. this, and got up there. Oh, I've always wanted to get some of these to make tables on. Oh. People sell them for like a hundred bucks a piece. Look, look, babe. You turn it into a table. Yeah, we could put that in our backyard. I know. This is kind of cool. What is it? It's a dog and it's dead. I'm going to throw it. I'm not. Oh, my God. Mm. Yeah, it is. Someone lives here, huh? With the dog? But yet, here's the dog and it's dead. You think if someone, like a squatter or something, lives here, they would just leave their dog laying out like that? No. Or is that a. What's weird is there's a haircut kit right here. And like, it's like people were taking pieces of hair off of it. Oh my god. Tell me this isn't weird. Field of Screams? Oh God. Look at this. Whoa. 
I should find out what house it is before we even attempt to go in here because now I'm really creeped out. Guys, this is Field of Screams. Why do I have my light on? <laughs> it's daytime. I don't know. This is creeping me out. Oh. What? For sure. Look at the extension cable. It's running over to here for power. Oh, outside. It's right there. See? They probably couldn't get inside. Or this is just how it was set up back. This was their gazebo or something. That could be. So what are these? I say we just go in. So far, though, that's proven to be right. The, the dog's dead. Yeah. Of course, no one's going to answer us if they're. Wait a second. What? It's not breathing. <clears throat> answer me this: If you were homeless or squatting, and if someone yelled in and said what we said, would you? Would you respond? No. Because you're not, because it could be a cop or anything. You don't know yeah, who it is. That's true. Well, we kind of scoped this place out, and I think we're just gonna go in. <laughs> so, takes a lot of balls to do this. After, I mean, that was kind of weird. That guy said that there was a guy and a dog who lived, lived here, and now we found the dog and it was dead. But I don't know. We'll find out. Stay alert. Let us know anything that you hear, see. Let us know down in the comments. It's always appreciated. Let's get to it. We ready to do this? Yeah. Let's do it, Ninja. <laughs> Ooh. She's gonna come in. God damn it. Personally, if it's during the day, I think I'll only closer to evening. That's fine. Yeah. Hello? We're not the cops, we're just exploring. There's lights. There's power. There's power. The lights are on. No. 100% the light is on in here. That's a little weird. Considering the fact that what he said. Oh, well, they had the stuff blocking that up against here, the bridge and stuff, and people just pushed it down. They had to have. Fuck. Stay alert. Okay, there's just a cowboy hat sitting right there. Uh, really? Can we have, is this a side door? We could have just came in this door. The fucking grass just sitting there. Let me turn my light on. Oh yeah, we totally could have. Oh my god, we didn't like that. <laughs> That's okay. We took the fun way. Piano. I just... You heard that it's the same sound that I heard. Hello, do you want us to leave? You heard that downstairs, right? Heard that back room? No, that was downstairs. No, I bet you it's a back room. It was a clicking noise. There's a light on in here. Tell me, that's just weird. I'm gonna need you to come close to me.
feels just a bear to put the mattress in the ground. I think somebody's in here and they're not letting themselves be known. If somebody is in here and you're not letting yourself be known, that's not going to be good for you when we meet. I am armed, fully loaded. So it would be best, in your best interest, just to let me know that you're here. Instead of scaring me and spooking me. Because if I get spooked, it's not going to be good. Somebody walking. Yeah. Wonder if you had the ghost. A man and yeah, old school like. A man and his dog. What is that fucking noise? Okay, I'm getting out of this room. Let's go. Look at someone like freshly dyed their hair here. Get out of this room, because we'll be backed in a corner in this room. Was it like a glass shower? We don't know that. Okay. Hello? non-perishables it's like doesn't look that old what? I bet you that fucking that still look at 142 it's blinking there's power in here oh yeah look at the green light on the key of power yeah to me that sounded like a breaker that was flipping that noise downstairs That's the sump pump. That's the sump pump That's going on we and off. That's what we're hearing. That still doesn't mean somebody's staying here. Though. We need to get up there and get start. Yeah. Yep. Somebody's definitely fucking staying here. For sure. Guaranteed. Watch this. It almost worked. No Crap, way. It just turned on. Oh my god. <laughs> There's heat? Wow. Oh my god. Yeah. Someone's squatting in here for sure. I would be. Fuck yeah. Nice pad you got here. <laughs> 